Circle 7 is just past Kettering and I can already see it from Cambridge. Whatever distance that is, I'll work it out later and put the information. I'm just going to show you. I'm going to film this. is probably going to end up being a fairly long video because this is quite a few miles from Cambridge. But here we go. So Kettering from where I am in Cambridge. Unbelievable that I can actually see a plane that's that far away. That's 26 times zoom. I'll just show you how long the contrail is. And then there, unfortunately there's cloud further further down. But this is at 39,000 feet. It's a UPS plane coming from America on its way to Germany, Cologne. And uh, it looks like it's going to pass a little bit south of Cambridge in a few minutes' time. Just crazy that I can see a plane this distance. Anyway, I'm going to go for more zoom. That's 56 times zoom, so you can see more of the contrail. Swirling out of those powerful engines. Right, obviously it's getting closer to Cambridge. It's still way west. I'm just going to check where it is on the radar. Where is it now? It's now over Grafham Water. Okay. Let's carry on getting some more just so I know. So Grafham Water in relation to where I live. Let's have a look. It's so surprising. You'd think it would be... If you were to drive from here to Grafton Water, I don't know, it would take probably half an hour or so, if not a bit more. The plane's going to do this in a couple of minutes. Oh, this is where it's going to get awkward. I've got the sun just below me. Below where I'm trying to film, so I've got the sun in my eyes. Try and film it a bit more on the side so I can get more in the same shot. That is 25 times in. Go for a little bit more, 30 times in. I'm going to stop following the plane so you can watch the contrail change. Ugh, I've got the sun right in my eyes now, this is really awkward. my roof any second now. I can hear it now. There you go, it's gone over my roof so I'm gonna go and um, carry on filming from the back of my house quickly. Let's just see where it's gone. Just passed over Sawston. Sawston's a little village not that far from Duxford. I'm sure you've heard of Duxford, Duxford Air Show. Let's get a bit more footage of this. It's 30 times zoom that is. I'm going to lose it behind some trees soon, so I'm going to stop following the plane and let you watch what happens to the contrail as it swirls. Okay, I'll stop following the plane now. See how much it swirls? I love that. I do love to see that. 
Let's go for more zoom. 58 times zoom. As soon as the plane goes behind a tree, right now, I'll stop. There you go, right, so I can still see it through the tree a bit. And then let's just show you what the contrail's done. See how the wind starts to break it apart, I love to see that. I always say it reminds me of DNA. Double helix kind of looks like that. And then it's fading away as it gets near to my house. So that's that, heading off southeast, and the moon is up there. That's 52 times zoom on the moon. Right, so I'll go back to my computer now and I'll show you um, the information. I'll show you the registration, the height, the speed, etc. etc. seconds and I'll be there. For that I'm going to use flightradar24.com uh, Right here we go. I click on that. Okay that shows you the flight path where I've just filmed it. So it's already past Braintree within a second near to Mark's Tay. That's where I filmed that really special RAF fly bus where they flew just about every type of RAF plane that they they use a couple of years ago. That was brilliant. So came over Grafton Water and that's roughly where I started to film it, wasn't it? Somewhere around. I know Kettering. Kettering is where I started to film it from. Let's just fully show the flight path. So Kettering, Burton upon Trent, south of Liverpool near Chester. Across the, across the sea, below the Isle of Man, across Northern Ireland. If I zoom the map out just to cross the ocean quicker. Newfoundland, where did it go across Newfoundland? Nearish to, what does that say? Labrador Inuit lands. Well, anyway, across here. Quebec. What's that there? No, just, just disappeared on me now. That airport there. God, it's a blooming long flight. West of Toronto. London. London International Airport. Hmm, okay. Uh, west of Cleveland. Over Ohio. Past Dayton. Cincinnati. And here we go. This is where it's come from. Louisville, Louisville International. Right, so here's the flight information. Took off slightly late. It's going to arrive slightly late. Still got another 38 minutes to go to get to Cologne. UPS, as I said, Boeing 747. There's the reg. N582 UP. 39,000 feet. And it's going very fast, 606 miles an hour at the moment. And there's your hex code. So, there you go. Thank you very much for watching. Time is now 5.43pm in Britain. Friday the 3rd of April 2020. Okay, thank you for watching. Bye bye. Don't forget to look at my other videos. I've got loads of other videos of contrails. I've got all kinds of air shows I've filmed. Look at them and by all means please share them to family and friends on Twitter and Facebook groups and uh, anything else you can think of, Dig, Reddit, whatever. Right, thanks for watching. Bye bye.